Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel where we discuss the latest tech news and rumors. Today, we'll be talking about the highly anticipated iPhone 15 reveal. We've got some exciting news and leaks to share with you, so make sure you stick around until the end of the video. So first up, before we get into the reveal, we've got a new leak from Leaks Apple Pro on Twitter. According to them, there's not going to be an iPhone 15 Ultra this year. Instead, it will be the same as last year's lineup, with an iPhone 15, a 15 Plus, a 15 Pro, and a 15 Pro Max. However, they also mentioned that next year's lineup will include the iPhone 16 Ultra that sits above the iPhone 16 Pro Max. Moving on, we have some news from Max Weinbach. He says that while the iPhone 15 will have much slimmer bezels, it's not going to be good for those of you that use screen protectors. The new bezel is going to have a 0.1mm slope on the display's edge, which backs up previous news about the iPhone 15 being more curved, starting from the bezel, similar to the Apple Watch. Next up, we have another leak from Unknowns21, who posted an image of the iPhone 15 Pro, but unfortunately, only the bottom part is visible. The photo confirms the presence of USB-C on the iPhone 15, although as we know from previous rumors, the USB-C port may also need authentication, which means you'll still need to buy Apple-compatible cables. While there's no way to verify the legitimacy of this photo, Unknowns21 previously leaked some internal documents confirming other specs, so it does seem pretty credible. Finally, we have the reveal of the iPhone 15 Pro, thanks to LeakCAD. This shows us some changes to the design, although it's not quite what we were expecting. The renders, created by Ian's elbow, thanks to the leaked CAD by Max Weinbach, show that there are curves that join the front and back panel to the frame, but it's not as curved as we were expecting it to be. Personally, I'm happy to see this as I like the flat edge design, and the extra curves are just going to make it more comfortable to hold. Another big change to the iPhone 15 seems to be on the camera bump, which is much larger on the iPhone 15 Pro and protrudes more from the back panel. The obvious reason for this is, of course, going to be better cameras, so hopefully, it's to make room for a larger sensor and maybe the new periscope camera that we've all been waiting for. The CAD also confirms the presence of USB Type-C, along with capacitive touch buttons for the volume rocker, power buttons, and the mute switch. Even at this early stage, CAD data is provided to case manufacturers, allowing them to prepare for the new phones before they release. So it's very likely that this information is correct. And that's all for today's video on the latest news and leaks about the upcoming iPhone 15. While we may not be getting the iPhone 15 Ultra as previously speculated, it's still exciting to see the changes and improvements that Apple is bringing to the table with this new lineup. From slimmer bezels to larger camera bumps, the iPhone 15 is shaping up to be a device that's worth keeping an eye on. Make sure to subscribe and follow our channel to stay up to date on the latest news and rumors about the iPhone 15 and other tech developments. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.